My friends, it's Michelle Cunningham. I'm excited to be here. Okay, so I'm super stoked because I have a guest speaker today. Her name is Dorothy Inez, and she is someone who I've met on social media. You know how you like make friends on social media? Well, she's my new friend, and she is absolutely crushing it in her direct sales business using online strategies. And the other day, she casually mentioned that she had booked 14 virtual appointments, sometimes 17 virtual appointments. I'm like, whoa, 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 what are you doing? I'm like, that is something that that I need you to come and train uh, for us, right? That you could hear what she's doing. And so guess what she said? She said yes, which is amazing. If you're watching, let us know where you're watching from and how excited you are for this training. So I am going to bring her on. And I just, let me let me quickly share with you her, her backstory because she's a super impressive person. When you get to know her story and you get to meet her and you hear her heart, you're going to be like, man, she's super duper likable. Okay, so Dorothy Inez Del Tufo. And her name is Dorothy Inez. Like that's how you say her name. Uh, Del Tufo is a three-time international best-selling author, inspirational speaker, and a confidence coach who helps high-achieving women and leaders in direct sales show up in video with more purpose and power through spirit, through a spirit-centered approach to personal presence. Do you love this, right? She believes that when a woman knows who she is, she boldly and unapologetically owns her call to serve. She holds a master in organizational psychology from Azusa Pacific University. And when she's not working with clients, she's studying spirituality, watching movies, and listening to her favorite Prince music. She's a Prince fan. So welcome to my fabulous friend, Dorothy Inez. Hello. Oh, and, there, and there he is. Where, where is he? There he is. He loves He's Prince. Here. He's here with me. He's always here with me. <laughs> it's so funny. I don't really, I don't know anything about Prince. Maybe I gotta, I gotta, I know his songs maybe, but. <laughs> of course you know his songs. Purple yes. Rain, Purple Rain. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna, I'll mute my microphone so you have more like, you can like share because otherwise I mess up your audio. So we are excited to have you. Thank you for donating your time. I know how important you are. So I just appreciate you coming on and sharing well, with everybody. You. Thank you, Michelle. I thank you so much for just allowing me to share um, what I'm learning as I learn um, with all of the men and women that are in your community, because I feel like that's what it's all about, learning from each other. And yes, that's how is. we grow. So I just appreciate your heart and your spirit. You know, I'm always telling you, Michelle, I finally met like my spirit animal. <laughs> <You know? laughs> I love so, you, my friend. Thank awesome. You. Thank okay, you. so I will mute, and I know you've got a freebie for everybody too. So I'll make sure yep. I jump into the group, and I'm going to share that link for everybody. I'll do that now, and then you can mention it a little bit later too. Okay. So, okay, awesome. Okay, All I'm right. going to mute, so I give you the stage here. Okay, thank you. Welcome, everyone. I'm so glad that you are here today, and I'm super excited to share with you what I'm learning. Um, as we, you know, as we're all growing right now in this virtual environment, we're all trying to figure out how do we book those clients? How do we continue to make those sales and prosper and provide for our families? And so a couple weeks ago, actually, yeah, really a couple weeks ago, two weeks ago, that's what a couple means, right? I um, decided, you know what, I'm going to bust out um, a bunch of calls, reach outs, and I'm going to book my calendar full. And I was telling Michelle about it, and I couldn't believe that once I set my mind to it, my, my, my director had said, Dorothy Inez, I want you to get um, 30 faces on your, on your books this month. And I was like, well, I don't know, 30, that's a lot. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I booked 17 in one day and I consistently, you know, like, like uh, Michelle said, between 14, 17, it just depends on what I put my mind to book these on a regular basis. So I want to share with you what I did. And I've got 10 steps that I'm going to share with you today. And you can write those down. Or like Michelle said, they're going to be in the freebie that I've created for you um, that has my scripts. It's got the um, how I did it, the steps, and a little tool to help you track that. So the first thing I, I did was I set my intention. This is one thing that it's so important is why 
why do you need to book these parties? Why are, are these parties or events important to you? What change are they going to make in your life and in your business? So that's step number one. Number two is have a goal. By booking these parties, how much do you want to bring into your business? How much income do you want to create in your business? And I'm going to add to that because one thing I like to say is I like to create not only income, but impact. Because our business isn't just about us selling a product. Our businesses are about us being a part of the change that we want to see in the world. So not only have a monetary goal, but a heart goal because you bring that energy to your intention. And then, of course, third step is creating a date. You know, when do you want to do it? And depending on what your business is, like in my particular business, I have to send out products. And so I have to book people minimum. The least amount of time is two weeks in advance. Three is ideal because that gives me enough time to let that person invite their friends, invite their family. It also gives me enough quality time to follow up with the person. So choosing your date um, is really important. And also one thing I noticed is be conscientious of holidays um, and be conscientious of time of day. That's key in, um, in whether or not people will say yes. And what I've done is I have my date book and I have on my date book, these are the dates I'm available. I only work sat or excuse me, Fridays and Saturdays. And I work on Fridays at six. Doesn't matter what your time zone is, six o'clock for me, that's when I'm gonna work. Um, Fridays, I, I mean, excuse me, Saturdays, I do, um, I do two o'clock and, and seven o'clock on Saturdays. So know when you're going to book so you can immediately put, you know, plug these people into your schedule. And then the next thing I did was create a list. And this is where a lot of people get stuck. I found, you know, when I'm working with my team, I have a nice little starter team of women and they tend to get stuck on, well, I don't want to reach out to, you know, so-and-so because I don't want to just reach out because um, they haven't heard from me and I'm just now reaching out to get them to do a party or, or buy my products. And here's what I know. If you come with a pure heart, pure intentions, a heart to serve, that's going to come across in your energy. But if you come through and it's all you want to do is sell and book a party, let me tell you, that too is going to come across. So have a, you know, a pure heart. That's what part of my name means. Dorothy, I, Dorothy Inez. Dorothy means gift of God. And Inez means with a pure heart. So I'm always coming with that pure heart part of myself. So make a list of names. Go through your Facebook. And I know a lot of you are thinking, girl, I've heard this before. But here's the thing. I want to invite you to just be open to what I'm sharing because what I'm going to share with you to do with that list might be might be a little different for some of you because this was my secret sauce. So right now I'm just helping you set it up, okay? So write a list of at least 50 names and have a tracking system. Um, and I'm going to show you that tracking system that I use. Then the next thing I want to do, because see, those of you that are here, you know, Michelle's always talking about we need to grow our email list, right? So one of the things that I do is I have a Google, a Google Doc, a Google Form, actually, a Google Form that every person who wants to sign up for any of my events, they have to fill out that Google form. Because here's the deal. You don't fill out the Google form, you just don't get in the class. It's that simple. But I get all their pertinent information, their address, their email, their phone number, all of that information. And now I'm building a list of potential clients in the future. If they don't, you know, even if they don't show up, I got all their info. Hold on. 
I always know to have water handy. Uh, so create that Google, that Google sheet and in the freebie that I've created for you, I have included my Google sheet so you can literally just copy it, edit the questions so that they match your particular business. So then you wanna develop your social media graphics. Now this part is really, you know, you know, I like to do that because I like to put it out and broadcast it and make it like a really cool event. And then I'll just show you the one that I created for my, um, here's one. This is the one that I created. This was because this was for my glam session that I booked. I actually ended up with 22 women in, um, in the, the class. So this is the one I created. Make it fun. You don't have to be a makeup artist like me. Um, let me see if I unshare. Did I unshare my screen? Good, I've unshared my screen. And then uh, since I've been inviting people to host them for me, I started including, it says glam session hosted by, and then I put the person's name to kind of help them feel extra special because it's a part of really booking and getting your, your parties to hold is really making that host or hostess feel extra special. And so any little thing I can do to make her feel like a star that's what I'm gonna do so um, create your private Facebook group because that's where you want to really hone these people in and what I started doing from day one is I started inviting them to engage ask them you know where are you from what are you hoping to learn from so you start building that sense of community start sharing a little bit about you so that they're super excited to be a part of this um, and I would almost say if this is a virtually a virtual event like I hosted is I wouldn't put you know I wouldn't have too, you know too much um no what's the word don't put it out there too too early because then that's like two weeks you got to try to keep these people entertained I would do like a week or so you know earliest now here's the secret sauce you guys are you ready are you ready to hear what I did so what I did is I grabbed this thing right here. I grabbed this thing called my cell phone and I went into Facebook Messenger and literally, you know, reached out to people I didn't even know because remember, I, Jasmine, stop it. Sorry, my dog, she just growls at everybody who, who walks by. <laughs> um, so what I did is I reached out to every single person that was on my list and I'm going to share with you one of the scripts that I that I use because I kind of write these out. I went back and listened to them and I'm like, hey, and you if you you could say you could do it one of two ways. You could say uh, keep it a generic message. And that generic message could just be something that you record in your audio, um, what is it, audio messages, audio notes or something like that. And you could just do it generic and say, hey girl, this is Dorothy Inez. I hope you're doing well. Life has certainly changed, right? I know it's been tough for many women, so I'm reaching out to bring you a little bit of light in your world by inviting you to my upcoming virtual blank session. I'm super excited to host it. The sessions are fun, educational, and a chance for you to get together with other women. Let me know if you're open to hearing the details. So I didn't give them the information right away. So, and then I said, I'd love to see your beautiful with us. Then they respond. So it creates a little bit of dialogue between us versus just, you know, regurgitating everything that they, you know, that um, all the details. And then I say, when they say yes, I say, thanks so much for being open to hearing about the session. I'm hosting the session live on blank. You'll receive a little glam bag in the mail that has everything you need. And you can just fill that in. Just take the script and make it yours. All you need are your makeup brushes and a mirror. And if that sounds great, fill out this form. I've attached the link below. Um, the only thing I ask is that you honor your commitment and show up. I look forward to seeing you.
And so even in asking them to commit, can you see how your voice tone makes a difference versus just sending somebody a text? And the cool thing when you do the audio message, ladies and gentlemen, people are curious. They're like, what is she saying? You know, what's on that message? I want to know. And so the voice message has been key. I've shared this with several members on my team, and this is working for them, and I know it will work for you. You just have to bring your personality to it, bring your heart and your soul to it, because at the end of the day, our businesses are really not about us. Our businesses are about serving. It's about us. For me, it's about us being God's hands and feet on the earth, serving the world through our, our gifts, our talents, and our services. And so I wanted to just add, so that's pretty much how I did it. Audio messages, having my little friendly script here. And I'm just, you know, um, myself, super excited to serve women. And I have to tell you that party, I ended up having over 50% of the women show up live on the party. And those who did not show up reached out. I would say it I, of the 50%, another 50% reached out because I had that commitment in there that they were committing to participating. So that's real, that's a real important part to have on your um, have on your sheet. And then I just want to give you a couple of little um, bonus tips because one thing I know is that I am so good at keeping my part that that let me see how do I word it. I'm so good at keeping, you know, my hostesses holding their parties, if that's how we want to word it. My, I rarely have a hostess cancel, and part of that is because I, I keep my, um, my enthusiasm so high. I'm following up. This is so key. Don't just book a hostess um, or a host and then just kind of leave them floundering out there. And then, you you know, comes the day before the party and then you're checking in. I have a system in place. When I book them, like I said, I usually book them two weeks out. They get one week to book. I give them a date by which they must have all of their people fill out that form. So if it's, let's say, today's Wednesday and um, your party closes, you know, RSVPs are by, you know, Friday the 11th. Well, I'm going to check in with you on Monday. How's the booking going? Do you need any help? Oh, okay. Okay. I like to send them a script as well. I have a script for that, that I send them a text message that they can send to invite their people. And then I check with them again today, Wednesday. How's it going? We got two more days. I really want you to get that free product. I really want you to have a successful party. How's it going? And I just keep that energy up. So the main thing is, have an energetic, enthusiastic um, attitude, um, have a heart to serve, use your voice as a tool to get people engaged and follow up. So that's how I did it. And um, I want to invite you, like Michelle said, is to go ahead and check out my free gift, my downloadable that I have for you. Oh, there's one thing I forgot. So in your in your downloadable, I created I'm a I'm a competitive person. I don't know about you, but I'm competitive. And so <clears throat> I like to use this little dot sheet and I gave you I, ma I made one for you in the in the um, guide. And I like to um, track all the people that I talk to and the goal is is to get these the, get these circles to become colored in and the more color I see the more excited I am and sometimes I go over those 50 names because I'm like I need this whole damn sheet filled out <laughs> because I'm just so competitive with myself and I just I'm like I only need two more I only need two more because sometimes when we just write the names you know just write the names down and we don't have like a tally going 
we can kind of not be as motivated, but having that visual for me allows me to compete with myself. So I've included that for you. You've got the link to my Google sheet. So I'd love to hear from you. Um, if you try the, try out the technique that I'm sharing with you and I invite you to message me and let me know, Dorothy Inez, that worked or Dorothy Inez, that did not work for me. Let me know your feedback. I love hearing from you. And if you added something you know, to it that added that little extra kick, share okay share with all of us we all want to know we're here to grow and serve together so again thank you so much for taking your time to listen in and i hope in some way what i shared today blesses you so thank you thanks michelle girl you're so good i mean people are going bananas in the comments oh, they I love it they you. printed you if you go to your upper right corner, if you're on a computer and you type, hit comments, you're going to see all the comments. People are going, oh, uh -huh. there it is. Okay. so yeah, I know it's weird if you don't know. So I posted the link a few times. Some people are saying, how do I get the guide? If you joined us late, just scroll up or down in the comments of where you are. I went to each platform and shared it on all those because group. So I shared it somewhere in the comments of wherever you're viewing from. So you can grab her guide, which it's so pretty. She's so good. You're so good at designing things and like yeah, making everything look really stuff. professional. So <laughs> I love it. And I so, see yeah, my she's, girl I, Rochelle is on. Hi, Rochelle. Mwah. Had to give her a shout out. <laughs> Rochelle. So, well, thank you. Okay. So a drawing i just like it i like to do a little drawing so I, let's do a giveaway i always have things you know i've got um i've got what do i have i have so many fun things i have a unicorn makeup bag that's what I, who Ooh. doesn't like a unicorn makeup bag that's what i use for my makeup it's actually pretty big and it's really great but that's what we're going to give to someone so i'm going to just randomly pick someone who said got my guide if you're like wait i need to say i'm not cheating so i'm gonna there i'm gonna this I click on someone it has to say like like if i hit this one it would have to say got my guide so so everyone say got my guide got my guide and i whoever as long as you got your guide and if you're like wait how do i get my guide <laughs> just scroll up or down and find that link and you can grab the, the thing and feel free to share this too if you have friends in direct sales sometimes this stuff is good good little nuggets so um okay got my guide got my guide here we go all right ready here we go. Okay, I'm gonna hold on. We gotta wait. They're still piling in, so I don't. I'm gonna give it a second. My phone. I just sat on it. It's recording me. You know what I just did there. Okay, ready? All right. Okay. Okay. Now they're in. Okay. Good. All right. So I'm gonna go up. Oh, someone loves unicorns. Here we go. I go down. I go up. I go down. I go up, and I click. Boom. Okay, Debbie Jarvis, you are the winner. <laughs> A magical unicorn makeup Yo, bag. Debbie. <laughs> Yay, Debbie Jarvis. Okay, so Debbie, I gotta find you. Um, actually, Debbie, you could email me, uh, Michelle at. Let me see if it's up here. Hold on, hold on. Edit. Do, do, do. Michelle at michellecunninghamonline.com. Online.com, and I'll send you that unicorn makeup bag. And if you do it like right now, I could do it. Send it to you right now. So, congratulations, Debbie. Um, Yay, Debbie. <laughs> And thank you, my friend, for being on. This was super duper amazing. I know probably super helpful. I just love people that are like in the field, uh, you know, that you're in the field, you're doing it. You're like doing the everyday stuff and you're getting results. And so um, I just commend you for all the hard work that you're doing because you're amazing. And um, you. I know you're, you're also a really big time confidence coach and you help people get unstuck. And so I admire what you're doing for the industry and the people that you're helping because I think you're just super amazing. So oh, thank you so much, Michelle. And again, I just am so blessed to be in your energy and in your space and just part of everything that you do. I thank Rochelle Beachy for turning me on to you. She's like, you oh. gotta know Michelle. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> and I love Rochelle. So it's so cool. It's just funny how we all meet and we become friends online. It's kind of a cool mm -hmm. thing. So Mm -hmm. Well, I appreciate you, my friend. I love you. Okay. I love your heart. And uh, thanks okay. again. All right. Bye-bye, everyone. All right. <laughs>